Hey, I'm Karen Eber Davis. You have a good problem. You have a board that's active in the meetings and engaged in what you're doing when they're together, but they're not so interested in maybe your small fundraising events and social media activities you'd like them to be doing. So this is a good problem because they are already active and there's some things you can do. First off, begin by making a measurement of where they are now. Number of ways you can do this, but the goal is, is to say, okay, they're not doing that much. What is it are they doing? Do they have actually some social media activity? Are they doing anything? Is it zero or is it really like five and we want it to be 20 times a month? It depends on where you're at. Many times boards are doing things like we asked them and we're not celebrating. We're not saying, this is so great, you're doing this. Can you do more? Which is a lot different than saying, you're not doing anything again. Now, I know you don't do that, but the message comes through that we're disappointed in you. You're not really performing. You're not doing what we hope. Instead of saying, it's so great you're doing something. Let me show you how to do more and be even more effective for us. So you've done that. So where are we at now? Another piece to do is to be a very, very careful about what you ask. Are you really asking important things? Or are you asking for things that really don't matter and are asking for hundreds of them? The goal here is to identify what are the 10 or five most critical activities we want this board to do in this next quarter, in this next year. Once you know that, you're ready for your third piece, which is conversations with board members saying, what is it that you love? What is it that you can really help us with? We have these 10 critical activities. Which of them feels like it's yours? And so it may not be that every board member plays the game and does the social media piece or whatever activities you want them to do. But if you get the important things done and they love doing it, you'll find there's more spillover into other activities that maybe they don't love so much, but they want to put part of the team, that they see that the effort is working and that their efforts can be magnified by their other team members doing activities together. So I am Karen Eber Davis, and there's lots more about how to work with boards, how to raise more money in my newsletter called Added Value. The link will be in the narrative of this video.